Thank you, Mother, Father, God. Thank you, Archangels and Ascended Masters, for the perfect grace, perfect clarity, and perfect peace that is here for each of us and all of us right now. Thank you to the angelic realm, the elemental realm, our ancestors, spirit guides, animal guides, and guardian angels. We thank you for this opportunity for wonderful grace and perfect peace. We thank you for this opportunity to receive help. We thank you for the highest good being present with us right now in this moment. And we celebrate everything having an evenness to it and everything having brilliance to it. We welcome the brilliance of our bodies to be met with perfect angelic healing in our physical bodies, emotional bodies, mental bodies, and energetic bodies. We celebrate this wonderful opportunity for something brand new to happen, for things that are existing to have grace bestowed upon them, for anything that feels hard or stuck or impossible, for the wonderful solutions to come forward and ease and relaxation. We welcome the absence of problems. We welcome the presence of grace. And we allow indeed the highest possible good to be present with us right in this moment. And we celebrate that right now. So we'll just breathe in. And let's just breathe into peace. And perhaps we could just feel that peace going into our lungs and into the back of our lungs. Let's acknowledge as we breathe and we notice wonderful breath being here, let's notice how we actually feel and recognize it's okay to acknowledge how we feel, any frustration, any concern, any pain on any level. And we'll just breathe in and we'll just very simply acknowledge how we feel. And we'll just lovingly and peacefully say out loud, Thank you, angels, for helping me in all ways right now. I surrender all my problems to you. I welcome perfect healing right now. I welcome a lifting of problems off of me right now. Thank you for being so considerate to all parts of me. Thank you. So we'll just wonderfully breathe into all that. And we'll notice great good and great peace being here right now. And we'll just breathe in. And if we can notice everything feeling very simple right now, nothing complex, no big task. And if we could notice perhaps our role in the next several minutes is to very simply just breathe and just be. And to very simply make room and allow the angels to have even more access to us. And if that feels like a stretch of your neck, if that feels like a stretching your arms, if that feels like a deeper breath, if that feels like leaning back onto what you're sitting on or lying down on, it's just very simply just take some physical action, even if it's very slight or subtle. And this is very simply just welcome. Welcome the peace that is here. Welcome the grace that is here. Welcome the love that is here. Welcome the harmony that is here. Wonderful. And if we could just feel, and this might be very subtle, if we could just feel as we breathe, our cells being very alive. And if we could notice Archangel Haniel, Angel of Grace, and if we could notice Archangel 
um, Metatron, who works with connecting things. If we could also notice all the angels we know by name, but specifically also Archangel Zadkiel, who works with everything mental, including consciousness. And also Archangel Raphael, if we could just feel ourselves being vitally alive and being in touch with the angels. So the trillions of cells in our bodies being in touch with the angels and the angels infusing very positive, very healing energy into every single cell in your body, the cells in your physical body, the cells in your head and every part of your head, including your mouth, including your sight, including all of your senses, including your cognition and your thinking. If we could just breathe in and just feel a wonderful infusion. And if we could do so without making anything, including ourselves, wrong or bad, just feeling help happening, help being here right now. So we'll just breathe into all of that. And let that tender care happen. And if we can indeed feel with the connections being made within ourselves and around ourselves by the angels, a wonderful connection between our hearts and the energy of hope. To feel anything causing pain, be that emotional pain or physical pain, or even an ache, if we could just notice that being tended to. And if we could let that extend, that notion of the healing of any pain, let's just let that have some room. And we'll notice Raphael helping with that, Sadkiel helping with any reconnections in the brain. And everything leaning toward you having a great experience of faith and trust. As we're working here, there's a doe right here who um, my friend is named Cookie. And Cookie looks like she's had a hard go. Like her, her fur is kind of not in great shape and she's got some nicks on her ear. We'll just notice that that doe who might be having a bit of a hard time is here and she knows that she's safe and that she's having some water. And if we could just notice that care is here and that care is here for you too. So whether we relate to Cookie or not, let's just very simply allow this moment be filled with healing, with grace, with ease. And what they'd like to very gently work on, this is mainly Archangel Raphael and Archangel Raziel, the angel of words and wisdom, is perhaps energies that could be a little heavy, but they want to work on them lightly, like resentment, like anger. So if we could just breathe in and very gently just let, let those energies be addressed by the angels. We don't need to go into things. Let's just very simply let those very specific dynamics be addressed by the angels right now. And allowing a new sense of hope and a new sense of grace to come forward right now. And we'll notice the energy of forgiveness, forgiveness of others, forgiveness of yourself, be that 1% or more. The energy of forgiveness, the energy of harmony. We'll just breathe in and allow the highest good to come forward.
So if we could just fill our lungs with air. And let's very simply give the angels 1% more room to work in. And let's affirm that the highest good is here for each of us and all of us right now. The highest good is here for you right now. The highest healing, the highest grace, the highest peace, the highest joy, the highest celebration, the highest hope, the highest harmony. And we'll just breathe in and we'll just notice with the release of big energies, we'll just notice there being more room immediately for calm, for grace, for ease, for peace, for anything that feels like a hard edge to become a rounded edge, to indeed feel seen and heard and cared for, to feel the presence already of solutions, to allow this moment and our next breath to be very f fulfilling. to welcome a great sense and experience of peace, to welcome a great sense and experience of love, to welcome a great experience of harmony. Wonderful. Good work, everyone. If we could just breathe in and we'll notice Archangel Ariel being present. And if we can notice Ariel working like an energy healer, and she'd like to work on chakras, starting with the throat chakra. So if we could breathe in, perhaps notice her hands being in front of your throat and at the back of your neck, whether she's touching you or not, or perhaps her hands in close proximity to your body. If we could just breathe in. And let Archangel Ariel heal, balance, and harmonize your throat chakra right now. And if we could perhaps release anything that might feel stuck, the things that you didn't say, things you wished you had said, things you did say, whatever is there, if we could just breathe and let there be harmony and freedom. And just feeling a wonderful balance and infusion from Archangel Ariel of wonderful harmony in all of your communications. And we'll just breathe into all this. And let's very simply relax into deeper peace and harmony. And perhaps we could be very light with consciousness right now. And in letting there be a balance of conscious and unconscious, we'll very simply let these beautiful, wondrous angels help in all ways right now, help you 
And we'll just breathe in and we'll very simply notice a wonderful balancing of all of your chakras with great care, with great love. And we'll just breathe in like we're receiving a massage or a energy healing or hands-on healing. If we could just breathe in and let there be a wonderful experience of grace and solutions and peace and letting the angels work on all levels right now. And we'll just very simply just breathe in with implicit trust for our highest good. We'll just breathe into the very thorough, very delicate, very caring, very loving healing that is happening right now on all levels into every cell, every system. To every part of your being. Wonderful. If we could just breathe into the energy like a really lovely fountain, like one in Europe, marble, water, flow, beauty, care, all the mechanisms working perfectly, and perhaps no hard edges. If we could just breathe into the flow that is here, and perhaps new sources of flow. new wellsprings of healing, new wellsprings of energy, new wellsprings of peace of mind, new wellsprings of joy, new wellsprings of guidance and clarity. 
We'll just breathe in to this wondrous, wondrous flow. We'll just breathe into all that. And if we could very simply Notice Archangel Ariel using her hands once again, whether you feel that, see that, hear that, or know that. This is very simply notice her placing her hands where you could benefit from it the most. Be that your heart, be that your mouth, be that your nervous system, be that a joint or a body part. Let's just breathe into her very delicate and deliberate healing touch. And as she does so, if we could notice her whispering to each chakra, whispering to the energy systems in your body, like meridians and auras. If we could just notice her whispering really gentle healing words and everything working perfectly. Great healing happening. The miracle of her healing touch. And with the beautiful lightness of figures in a Botticelli painting, if we can notice the angels very simply blowing air toward you, angelic air surrounding you, breathing in angelic air. So the healing happening inside of you, in organs and systems, on the surface of your skin, in every part of you, in your energy field, in your aura, in your chakras and meridians, in your heart center, in your DNA, in your Akashic records, on all levels right now. And in this moment of graceful expansion and great healing, if we could just very simply notice with sim absolute simplicity, not a big deal, if we could notice any pockets of disappointment, distress, or despair being acknowledged by the angels and dissipated. And that we're going to welcome this wonderful experience of contentment, fulfillment, solutions, peace of mind, grounded guidance, great calm, wonderful peace, love being infused into you, creating more space for self-love, self-worth, for overall well-being and hope, We'll just breathe into all of that. Mm -hmm. 
If we could notice with the healing that is happening from Archangel Ariel, her very deliberate touch, her expert and miraculous hands and energy and intention and prayers, her whispering to your chakras, we'll just notice with her whispering the vividness of the colors of the chakras being um, enhanced. The purple, the blue, the light blue, the green, the yellow, the orange, the red. The white, the magenta. You just notice whew, vibrant, vibrant colors. And we'll notice whatever this means to you, Archangel Metatron taking out the trash for you. And he's very good at that. We'll just breathe in. And we'll notice that you could focus right where you are. And we'll come back like the fountain or the beautiful Botticelli figures in his painting. We'll just notice everything being in flow. And we'll notice as we work on different layers, we'll just notice a removal of any static. And we'll just breathe in to even greater harmony. We'll just breathe into even greater grace, even greater love. Wonderful. If we could just breathe in, and we'll notice with her miraculous touch, and we'll notice with her miraculous voice, we'll notice Archangel Ariel saying your name several times, and we'll just breathe into that.
One of the elements of Botticelli's painting, Sandro Botticelli, is angelic infusion, the angels, him inviting the angels to infuse themselves into his paintings. If we could let, let's very simply invite the angels to infuse their energy into every single part of our lives. So we'll just breathe in and let's say out loud, thank you angels for infusing your energy into every part of my life. Thank you, angels, for infusing your energy into every part of my life. And if we could just breathe into the expansion that is here. And perhaps we could just generate a sigh. <sighs> and let things relax and release. I felt that in my heart, so we'll just breathe in. <sighs> Let's notice what it's like to hold on to nothing that doesn't serve you and to hold on to hope, to let our hearts be full, to trust that evolution is happening, to feel and see and witness and know in our hearts that the angels are touching every part of our lives, every relationship, every communication, our healing, our manifestations, our day-to-day -day activities, our inhabiting the spaces that we're in, all of our communication, and the highest, highest, highest possible good. So we'll just breathe into all of that. Wonderful. So we'll just breathe in. And we'll celebrate life right now. We'll embrace life right now. And we'll notice all that is being generated for us. Miracles, great conversations, peace of mind, healing, good news, very pleasant and happy surprises, miracles in nature, a wonderful experience of flow and grace and peace, being seen and heard, receiving wonderful, wonderful messages, be that from nature, be that from guidance and angels, be that from friends and loved ones, we'll just notice our receptivity and the grace and peace that is here right now. And we'll just breathe in and we'll just notice how vibrant and receptive and powerful and emanating our chakras are, our heart chakra emanating peace and love throughout our being and throughout our lives. All of our chakras being in tune with the angels being revitalized, rejuvenated, and welcoming the highest possible good and incredible peace. We'll just notice transformation. We'll notice the dough, 
who's here now, Ginger, very strong, very present, very intuitive, and her fawns being here. We'll just notice everything getting bigger, everything being present, and the highest good being celebrated right now. And with incredible grace, peace of mind, wonderful love, and incredible joy, we'll recognize our strength, we'll recognize that we are seen and heard, we'll recognize that goodness is here, and that the goodness extends itself into the next moment, into an hour from now, the rest of this day. A wonderful infusion into all conversations, into the atmosphere where you are, into other atmospheres or environments that you venture into, including gardens and cars, that we celebrate the highest good being here. We celebrate the grounding into new spaces, the grounding into existing spaces, the grounding onto planet Earth, and the wonderful connection between us and all the angels. And with a sense of wonder, peace, harmony, and joy, we thank the presence of Mother, Father, God, and all the archangels and ascended masters. We thank as well the angelic realm, the elemental realm, our ancestors, spirit guides, animal guides, and guardian angels. We thank you for the harmony and peace that is here right now. We thank you for all the grace and the good that is here. As we celebrate life, knowing that everything truly is in perfect and divine order in this moment and every single moment. And with harmony, grace, ease, and joy, we ask for this or something better right now in all directions of time. And so it is.